What's up guys, it's Gizzlemeck, and I am back with another Dokkan Battle video, and I'm excited because we just got confirmation not only for the Ultimate Gohan that was already confirmed in the uh, the V-Jump manga scans, uh, we also got actual physical uh, passes, which Brandon sent me. Thank you, Brandon, and thank you, Judah, uh, my friends, for sending it to me in the Dokkan Lives chat. I also got the super attacks. I'm going to put on the super attacks first. I want to watch those with you guys. Um, and afterwards, we're going to go look through the passive. These units look dope. So what I can, from what I can see, there's a free-to-play Kibito Kai that's coming out. And then there's the Gohan that's coming out. And the AGL West Kai card that I've been whining about getting an Awakening for like three months is finally getting a 120. We'll go through all those leader skills and passes and stuff in a second. But let's look at these super attacks. That's pretty dope. They fuse, dude. They fuse, dude. This is so cool, dude. Like, this is the kind of animation that I'm talking about with Dokkan lately. Like, they're just really nailing it. They're really, like, they're just straight up nailing it, dude. And I think this is a free-to-play card, by the way. Like, for free-to-play, these animations are pretty damn good. Like, this is free to play. Look at Gohan, bro. Oh, my God, dude. And he's in the Kai outfit. Using the sword, like, oh my god, these guys look great. These guys look awesome. These guys look awesome, dude. And this is go so that was Gohan's, I think, active skill where or his transformation or whatever. This is his super attack in ultimate. I'm curious. Is this gonna be like the anime? Ooh, ooh, ooh! What a dog! What the heck, dude? Oh my god, this crazy dude! Okay, and then the rest of this at the back is just the uh, the passive news. This is on Dokkan Battle News, so you guys can watch this on Instagram at any time that you guys want to watch it. If you want to see it on your own different stuff, um, but. Dude, like, this is crazy. Like, guys, it's, it's, oh my god, this is so crazy. Because, like, they're finally here. And I will have Jack Shaw go ahead and, uh, of course, uh, zoom in on these for you guys. But we got uh, Gohan Teen, Mastering Power Beyond Limits. Leader Skill, Savior's Category or Hybrid Saiyans, plus 3 key and 130% HP and 170% attack and defense. Huh. Saviors. We'll, we'll talk more about that at the end. I think that could be really good. Z Sword Slash greatly raises attack and defense and causes immense damage. Um, okay, that's pretty good. And I think he um, he infinitely stacks attack and defense. Uh, his passive is 140 percent uh, attack and defense. At start of every turn, he gains one key up to max three. Guard against all attacks. Gain an additional 40 percent for the turn when guards activated so he guards act he guards against all attacks so if you let him get hit once in a turn he's going to end up at 180 percent attack and defense flat and he can stack attack and defense infinitely that's monstrous links are brainiacs on the family Lin uh saiyan lineage cold judgment revival power bestowed by god fierce battle fierce battle excellent power still bestowed by god excellent cold judgment excellent especially with the jp link updates that's gonna be crazy. Okay, let me keep rolling. I don't want to keep you guys too long on this video. It's already been about four minutes. Um, okay, active skill unlock potential. Able to be activated once five uh, five turns have elapsed from the start of battle. So just five turns, no HP restrictions is great. Um, okay, categories: Saviors, Hybrid Sands, Resurrected Warriors is awesome. Majin Buu Saga, Goku's Family, Siblings Bomb, Revenge, Rapid Growth. Okay. So rapid growth just got a really good buff. There's a lot of great categories here, and revenge is going to be excellent. So as ultimate Gohan, the super attacks burst rush greatly raises attack for one turn and causes immense damage with a medium chance to stun. What? Okay, so he doesn't infinitely stack once he transforms. He only stacks for those five turns. So I think all additional for this guy sounds good, but I couldn't be sure. I'd have to see uh, him in action. His passive. Plus three key and 158% attack. 58 is because go you know 58 is Gohan's number. Guard activate against all attacks. Get an additional 40% when guards activated. Up to, uh, ooh, attacks effective against all types. If there's one enemy and their HP is 58% above, or if there's a Majin Buu Saga category enemy. So 
He will be effective against all types if there's a single enemy and if their health is 50% or above. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. And he gains shocking speed and Saiyan warrior race when he goes in the... Dude, this card's crazy. This card might be game-breaking, dude. Let's go over. Oh my god, that's crazy, bro. That This card might be, like, game-breaking. Okay. Supreme Kai and Kibito is next up on the list. Uh, they were the first Super we watched. And apparently, uh, they are free-to-play from what I'm hearing because of their leader skill plus 4 key and then 100%. Um, their super attack, I'm not reading. I, I don't know what that says. Greatly raises defense for one turn and causes supreme damage with a high chance to stun. Dude, passive. Plus two key and 120% attack. Attacked enemy gets defense and attack. Minus 30% for two turns. High chance to evade enemies' attacks and recover 10% HP. <laughs> Dude, this is free to play. Are you serious right now? This is free to play. Oh my god, dude. Okay, fusions. Uh, a bit. Okay, so conditions. Able to be used upon any attacking turn. So you can fuse on any turn where you attack. Interesting. Is that from turn one? Okay, I don't know how that's going to work. Will you just be able to pop that anytime you... Okay, that's weird. They're free to play though, so we'll see how that goes. Um, I'm 100%ing them. Like, certainly. Like, it's happening. Okay, I'm not going to worry about links for them. They do have Cold Judgment, which is cool. And Fierce Battle, which is great. Realm of Gods, Majin Buu Saga, Join Forces, and Patara is awesome. Uh, their super attack transformed is attack and defense uh, are raised for greatly for one turn. Causes supreme damage and seals the enemy's super attack. Plus three key and attack and defense 150%. All enemies attack and defense minus 20% once only. Stun the attacked enemy for two turns and recover 10% at the start of turn. Oh my, oh yeah. Guys, it's late. I don't even have the energy to be, dude. Oh my God, dude. Um, West Supreme Kai also got a uh, a whole awakening. I'm gonna actually do a separate video for my boo. Uh, she needs a whole separate video. I'm not even gonna do her in this video. I'm gonna give her a whole separate video. There's also a great Sandman one and two. I'm not gonna focus on them though because I don't wanna waste any more of you guys' time. Expect another video coming out where I'll be talking about her specifically, the West Supreme Kai AGL. Um, and what she's gonna be looking like afterwards but guys this is awesome this is this is great uh, it is it is crazy um it is going to be awesome and there's easy a's for super 17 and an easy a for majin boo um so anyway guys thank you so much for watching the video i really appreciate you guys um let me know what you guys think of this new gohan below let me know what you guys think about him what should we put in him crit dodge attack let me know what you're thinking of dokkan so far even let me know if you like a specific type of video that i've been doing anyway guys it's been gizmo making as always i'll see you in the other world have a nice one and goodbye guys